I have the new ballistic case for my LG V20. This is their crystal clear um, case. It's 12 bucks on Amazon. Um, I don't normally like the clear TPU cases. But uh, I like ballistic. And this one seemed to have a bit of extra protection. So I grabbed it and I am not displeased at all. It's crystal clear with a bubbly pattern. I kind of wish they would have got rid of the bubbly pattern. Just clear would have been nice because I'm going to put a skin on the back of my phone so you'll be able to see that through the clear case. Uh, unlike your typical TPU case, this one has beefed up quarters, which is a really big deal. Because even though the protection here for the screen is not too bad, it's a lot better than a lot of other cases. You get in there, you can see that. But you notice it's much bigger at the quarters. They basically uh, bulged the quarters. This gives the phone incredible protection. I mean, look, it, it literally bounces. <laughs> That's how much protection there is on the quarters. This is a dummy phone since I'm using my V20 to record. Uh, and that's on both sides. So it's thicker here and it's thicker here. You can see the quarters are significantly thicker. This gives you what you need. You need that dispersal, uh, dispersion of energy you get from the thicker material. And also it um, keeps the case from being destroyed. Because now instead of the case resting on this when you lay it down, it's resting on these four quarters. And that also means it's actually lifting the screen higher up off the table surface when you lay the phone down it does have a downside though because only the four quarters are touching it is very slippery it takes nothing to slide this around while if the case was actually in full contact with the table it would be uh, grippy but because it's only the four quarters touching it makes it very very slidey so it wants to move around so do be careful with that be be aware of that fact that you you're not going to be able to lay this down and have it simply not move because of the tpu's friction against the surface because you're only touching on your four quarters so catch 22 there but worth it because you because the phone really is a huge phone so this gives you the the lack of bulk and only adds the bulk where it's needed in the quarters so very very impressed i like this case let's pop it off so you can see the case itself you can see it takes a bit of force to get it off there which is a good thing it is perfectly clear how long it'll stay clear who knows but it is clear i do wish they would have done away with the bumps although all right now that i think of it the bumps do prevent the phone from coming in direct contact with the case which will prevent any grit that gets stuck inside of the case, which is a common problem with these skin type cases from, you know, gouging and scratching up your phone. So that is a potential benefit. So not a totally bad thing. I just would have liked the look of not having the bump so I can see. Cause I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put a graphic vinyl decal on the back of this. That's why I like clear cases. That's why I like my UAG cases, my Maverick. You know, same deal because it's clear i can see the graphic behind the phone so if i have a custom battery back or something like that or a vinyl decal which i've already ordered but yeah not a bad buy if you want a simple svelte case that's not going to add bulk it's not going to hide the phone and it's going to give you significant i would i would classify it as near uag quality protection I mean, not quite UAG, but pretty darn close. I would consider them pretty close to equal for a cheap price. I mean, it's $12 on Amazon. Go get it.